What's going on, guys? Welcome back to more of the Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. In the last part, we kind of struggled with the Stone Top Island. We really struggled with one room. This part, we're going to see what we can do in this uh, the rest of this temple. We already have five straight fairies, and uh, we do need to get out our Garn Mask. There, I might go back to Clock Town and get Chateau Romani, but that really depends on the time it is when I finish the first part of this temple. See how it is the night of the second day. All right, we got that. Not for another stray fairy. We haven't, we surprisingly haven't used many masks. To be fair, we will when we get the item. Let's get our Deku mask out. I think you, I think you use the Deku mask more in this temple than you than you've used in any temple since like Woodfall. Yeah, we're looking at kind of an hour and a half of in-game time to beat this temple. I think I can do it in an hour and a half. But it is a long temple. Like, I might have to just get the stray fairies, get the get the, get the the item you get with the stray fairies, and then just immediately reset time. Like, that's how, uh, that's how, how cut the corner, how cut the corners are is what I'm trying to say. Even when I've done this several times. Now it's our sixth stray fairy, and it's a. Uh... Notice how this is the same. Is it similar to the uh, boss I would fight the girl mask? We said it's a different uh, swordsman, but same thing. He's not really a hard boss, like. Uh... You roll out of the way when he goes towards you, and like, uh... You just bust out your shield. You kind of hit him from the back, is what I mean. Yeah, so like, uh, you gotta kind of hit... Hit him from the back like that, and he should be almost down. He's down. And this gets us the item. I don't know, really don't like skipping tax. I like how the chest spawned below us. That's kind of funny. We don't need the Deku mask anymore. Actually, let's wait to look at the item. And we get the Light Era, which is the Light of Justice shall target evil, and this is the, uh, biggest reason I strongly recommend having a lot of magic. In fact, I might just go, might just, I might just cut my, I, I might just, when it gets to, like, 10 p.m., I might just cut corners and, like, um, go to the, uh, and get, and get Chateau Romani, regardless of if I'm actually done with this temple at this point. Or this section of the temple. There's still a lot of temple left. I think if I remember correctly, there's a switch, but I could be a wrong. Let's try the bottom. Let's touch the bottom. Oh, I'm thinking when you come back here later, so uh, never mind. This is a very complex temple. I think, okay, let's, uh, how do you get back up there? There's no way, no way I'm stuck down there. I know the way back up there, but like, uh... Right, I'm a little backwards. Thank God this game's hookshot's not the default hookshot from Ocarina of Time. 
But yeah, there's no. I know there is a striker in this temple, but we can't quite get it yet. And uh, yeah, uh, you kind of hit him with the eye. Except, look how much magic the light arrows use. Even though it only takes two shot, four shots. And all that just for a stray fairy. But we are getting all the stray fairies, so that is a win. And we're stri we're we're And now uh that's all we have left for this portion of that. Actually there is not quite not quite. We still have to get this right here. This is for when we come back. So, there's not much left we have to do in this portion of the temple. There's not much left we have to do in this portion of the temple, but like, uh... I am going to soar back to Clock Town just so I can get Chateau Romani. So, uh, I'll see you guys in a second. Come on, what does he have to say? What does he have to say? Yeah, bother, bother, I'm busy. Yeah, not quite the uh, curiosity peak, if I will say. Wait. All right, I sped up time to make it the uh, night of the set, the, the uh, 10, 8, 10 p.m. so I can get the Chateau Romani. I just went back to Clock Town. I've never actually showed getting the Chateau Romani, so why not more show it than now? And we just have to have the, uh, we just have to have the uh, mask on. You don't even have it in there. You just need to. All right, I did not mean to speak to him, have a drink. We're gonna get Chateau Armani. It's 200 rupees, but it's well worth the 200 rupees. We're just gonna, um, just screw the green potions. Why not have unlimited magic? Yeah, it's like, you can use all the light arrows you want. This is why I strongly, I strongly recommended, um, this is why I strongly recommended uh, going to get Chateau Romani before uh, going to Stone Tower Temple because, like, uh, now, now that I'm ha we're essentially halfway through Stone Tower Temple, but we're now going to soar back there. And thankfully, we're not playing the Japanese version, but uh, we're going to soar to Stone Tower. Thankfully, we're not playing the Japanese version because. Let's just say this method would be harder in the Japanese version. You have to come with Chateau Romani. We have to kind of... How do I describe this? I wonder if we have to find a way to flip the temple upside down. Now that we have the light arrows, we pretty much can. Except that's not the way to do it. I want to see if there's more arrows. We have bombs, magic. Not that ma magic matters. We have Chateau Romani. Yeah, that's the one you want to get down. Just a fair warning, though. Before you flip the temple upside down, any stray fairies that you might have missed, I would suggest getting them right away. Get all the stray fairies. Get up, get the light arrows. Get everything you possibly can. To get all the switches. Do all that before you flip the temple upside down. Because if you flip the temple upside down, you have to go. You have to go all the way back and flip it all and flip it right side up. We shoot a light arrow and miss completely. Miss 
this is actually a good part to lay it off in this part of Majora's Mask. So, uh, after the cutscene plays. So, yeah. Next time on Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask, we'll do Stone Tower Temple, except upside down. So, I'll see you guys next time. Later, folks. Bye.